Dead Internet Theory is a controversial idea suggesting that much of the content and interactions on the Internet today are not generated by humans, but by bots, artificial intelligence, or automated systems. The theory claims that since around 2016, a significant portion of what we encounter online whether it's social media posts, comments, reviews, or even articles has been produced by non-human actors. This alleged shift, according to proponents, makes the internet feel artificial and disconnected, with fewer real people contributing to discussions and creating content. Supporters of this theory argue that the vast majority of internet traffic and interactions are controlled or influenced by corporations, governments, or powerful entities who use bots and algorithms to dominate online discourse. These bots simulate human behavior by liking, commenting, or even writing content, thereby creating the illusion of thriving online communities. This can lead to the manipulation of public opinion, as users are often unable to distinguish between genuine human interaction and automated responses. As a result, conversations can be steered in particular directions, serving commercial or political interests. The theory also suggests that the nature of the Internet has fundamentally changed. Originally, the Internet was seen as a decentralized open space where people could freely exchange ideas and engage in meaningful dialogue. However, dead internet theory posits that this organic nature has been lost, replaced by a highly curated environment where algorithms and bots create the majority of visible content. In this view, platforms such as Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube are using AI-generated content to drive engagement, inflate user numbers, and generate advertising revenue, all while controlling the narrative that users see. Critics of the theory, however, argue that while automation and bots are undeniably part of the modern internet, this doesn't mean that human activity has been sidelined. The rise in bot-generated content is often a reflection of technological progress and the increasing use of algorithms to manage the overwhelming scale of online interactions. These critics also point out that there is little concrete evidence to support the claim that the majority of internet users are fake or that bots dominate online discourse. In conclusion, dead internet theory taps into widespread concerns about the corporatization and automation of online spaces. While it may offer an interesting lens through which to view the evolving nature of the internet, the theory remains speculative and is often criticized for oversimplifying complex issues related to technology, control, and online engagement. Nonetheless, it continues to resonate with those who feel disillusioned by the increasingly impersonal and controlled nature of the modern web.